What's up everybody, Tegan here at High Point Scientific. Today we're going to tell you all about the Aperture 60 EDR Apochromatic Doublet Refractor. And also make sure you stay tuned to the end of the video because we're going to show you some amazing examples of photos that some of our customers took using this exact telescope. So first thing is first, the Aperture 60 EDR is a 60 millimeter compact doublet refractor with a short focal length, perfect for imaging large nebula and galaxies. If you're just starting off with this hobby and you're looking for a somewhat smaller refractor, maybe something you can take camping with you, this may be the perfect option to go with. It's not only great for astrophotography, but it's also great for visual work. If you're going camping under dark skies and you put an eyepiece into this thing, it's going to provide you with some beautifully high contrast views with tack sharp stars. Scanning the Milky Way with this scope paired with the wide field eyepiece would be an awesome experience. On top of all this, the build quality is absolutely incredible. It includes a dual speed focuser, which is great for achieving a nice sharp focus, especially when using with a baton mask. The included camera rotator allows you to adjust camera orientation at any time so you can achieve that perfect framing around your targets. It also includes M48 filter threads for two inch light pollution filters, both narrow band and broadband filters. So if you're imaging in the city, this is really going to help your contrast in your images. The dovetail is reversible and this is going to help with balancing, especially if your assembly is a bit back heavy. The Aperture Field Flattener that comes with the Aperture Kit is designed to work with both the 60 and the 72 EDR doublet and it supports a full frame camera sensor. The only thing that we recommend you consider when purchasing the Aperture 60 EDR doublet is that you buy a four inch or a seven inch fixed and style dovetail to go with it. This is going to help you attach it to your equatorial mount. One of the minor differences that you'll see between a 60 EDR doublet and a higher end triplet is common with most doublet refractors and that is star size. The stars in a triplet refractor are going to be a little bit sharper than that of a doublet. So while all product prices are relative, we're not one to tell you if a product is expensive or inexpensive, but when you compare the Aperture 60 EDR to something like a high-end triplet apochromatic refractor, you'll find that the EDR is a fraction of the price but still provides apo-like results. All right, so now that we have the technicalities out of the way, let's take a look at some of these awesome photos that some of our customers have taken using the Aperture 60 EDR. <music> We thank you so much for tuning in. We really hope that you liked the video. If you have any questions, please let us know in the comments or you can reach out to us at highpointscientific.com and our non-commissioned product advisors will be more than happy to assist. Please remember to like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel so you do not miss any of our future content. Thank you so much and clear skies.